In this video, I wanted to have a brief talk about some ethical considerations that you should keep in mind if you are doing some reverse engineering and some exploit development. The purpose of this course is to help you learn more about software at a low level, help you learn what makes software vulnerable, and learn how vulnerabilities can be exploited. These things can help you improve an organization's security by helping them to discover vulnerabilities and responsibly disclosing your findings to the appropriate persons who can actually fix these problems. This course is not about learning how to break into other people's things. It is not about learning how to break your competitor's software in order to cause them harm and give yourself some sort of an advantage. It is not about learning to hack into or break into systems that you are not authorized to access. And it is not about learning how to reverse engineer software in cases where it's illegal to do so. So some guiding principles. All the work that you do should be done on machines that you own or have explicit permission to use. And any vulnerabilities discovered should be disclosed to the appropriate persons often the author or a company that produces the product, and not just released to the general public. Exploiting vulnerabilities on machines you do not own or do not have permission to test is likely illegal in whatever country you happen to be in at the time. So in summary, don't be a jerk. And if you don't listen and want to become a better jerk based on what you learn in this course, we're not responsible. So again, remember, make the world a better place. Don't be a jerk. I hope you enjoy this course.